advanced modeling one revolve command so here I have a sketch that is completed and I'm going to revolve this to do that I'm going to come up here to the revolve tool and right away it comes up and we want to select the profile so I'm going to pick the profile if there's only one possible profile it will automatically select it and so here it automatically selected it because it was the only profile available but if we have other things like holes and other parts you need to select the profile next you need to select the axes you want to revolve it around I'm gonna pick on this X axis here and it'll spin it around and I'm gonna just say okay for now and so I'm going to just take a look at it there and you can see that it spun that around now let's undo that for a minute here and let's do that again in a different way so I pick this axis but there's more than one way we can do this if we go up to revolve and it automatically found it that's okay now we gotta select the axes I could pick this axis as well let's just do that for a moment and you can see I can see that and I can say no I don't like that I can go let's say one of the things that a lot of students are learning is hey an axis can be part of the sketch so I could pick this edge right here and it will spin it around okay I could pick another part of the edge let's say over here spins it around so there's many edges we could spin about itself or on an, on an axis okay so I'm going to just select this axis here and let's go down the line and so the so the type of axis we're, or a type of revolving we're going to do is an angle for right now we can come back to the other ones later on and we don't have to go 360 degrees I'll go 270 for example and you can see here um, that you know now I get a good look at it okay so I'm gonna go back and I'm gonna undo that and let's do this again let's go and revolve and I'm gonna select the axes I'll pick on here and so you can see here that I can set any angle I want it'll default to 360 and I can spin it any particular direction around that revolve so let's say I have it at 45 okay and you'll see that it's spun it around from the from the axis that I just chose 45 degrees but it's only in one direction now I can go and say well I want to go symmetrical 45 degrees and it will spin it around each direction 45 degrees you can also go a two-sided so therefore I could have it at two different angles I could say one direction it's going to go 45 and the other one's going to go 90 and then I can say okay we generally are going to do new body which is creating a new work but I could have it join two parts or cut we'll do these later in later videos so I'm going to say okay and you can now see that I have now spun this thing around and you can see what it looks like so revolving is is really not that hard once we learn that a we need to choose the profile B we need to choose the axes we want and then we need to set what type of ro uh, revolution we want so and remember you can make a change to your sketch after it's revolved that's fine so revolving is one of the mainstays of our advanced modeling along with extrude.